I got excited when I saw the movie Red Tail. You know why I got, got excited? It wasn't because of the computer generated graphics. It wasn't because them boys look good shooting them planes down. You know what I got excited about? Because they were a group of young men that folks said didn't have the intelligence to fly a high performance fighter jet. They were killing folk with junk. But you know what I got excited about? I got excited because if God did it once, he can do it again. I got excited because I know that nothing is impossible for God. I got excited because I know if God's people lean and depend on him, that he'll make a way out of no way. I got excited because the Lord said, I will bless you and you shall be a blessing. We bless folk all around the world. There are folks still looking up to us. We got a job to do. And God ain't gave up on us. God hasn't turned his back on us. God's not through. So my question is, what you going to do? You going to sit back and see? Or you going to step up and do your part? Well, preacher, I can't do what I used to could do. You can pray. You can encourage some young folk. You can tell, you, look, 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 if, if, if you ain't bold enough to tell them folk in the street, tell them folk in your family that got your name, pull their pants up. If you, if you ain't bold enough to tell folk in the street, tell them young girls in your family to cover the girls up. We got to start somewhere. We have to start by letting our children know that they are marvelously and wondrously made, that God got great stuff in store for them. And folk don't want to acknowledge that they got what God put in them. We need to let them know you got to represent somebody. You representing the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. You've been covered in the blood of Jesus. Walk like you somebody. I'm going to leave that alone. 